Hey, so today I'm going to um, show you how to use VMP Mocker with the iPod Touch or the iPhone and I'm going to show you how to use it on a Macintosh. I'm on 10.4 but I'll run it through 10.5 as well. First we're going to hit System Preferences and go straight into Sharing. Okay, now under Services on the 10.4 you want to hit Apple Remote Desktop. On the 10.5 it's called Remote Management. On the 10.5 you'll have to hit Computer Settings after you've clicked on it but in the 10.4 as you can see it just comes straight up. Now the whole top half of this is irrelevant. On the 10.5 you won't be able to see that so just don't even pay any attention to it. And you just need to go onto the line VNC viewers may control screen with password. Now then, put the password in. For now we're just going to use Apple just so I can show you how it works. Then click OK. OK, now we're going to put in the password for that. OK, now here it should tell you that remote desktop control is on. That's the important thing. Just So just leave that on. And this number down here is going to be the IP address you're going to use for, to put into your iPhone or iPod Touch. Okay, now then, you're going to take your iPhone or iPod Touch and hit VNC right there, and you're going to click the big orange on button in the middle. And on the top bit, which is the VNC server IP address, you're going to put that IP address that I told you about before, you're going to put that in. I think mine was 10.0 point something point 0.5. If you just go ahead and put that in, 0.2.5, there you go. Now underneath that you'll see the VNC server port, just leave it at 5900 for now, just leave that there. And in the password, VNC password, you're just going to put Apple in, like we said before, like the one that I showed you about. And the rest of the options, including the name, you're just going to leave, you can turn all them on if you like, that's how I've done it, and just, just, just leave them all as they are. Now then, once we've done all of that, you're going to go ahead and click on connect in the top right hand corner. There we go. And that, that is it. It should just all connect up. And you can, you can see myself again in the screen as I'm showing you how to work it right now. So if you have any questions, just comment or send a message and I'll try and get back to you on your query.